Hello everyone and welcome to my tutorial. Today I'm going to give you a few tips on how to do a proper split. Now I just did two splits actually. The first one was the wrong version, and the first one was the um, the second one was the right version. So why is the first one wrong, and why is the second one right? I'm gonna explain you right now. While doing a split, your hips should remain straight, which means that your psoas should be kind of overextended. What happens in a fake split is that? You get to do your lovely split. When you're facing the camera with your glutes, actually, it doesn't show, but when you look from this side, so from your belly button side, you realize that something is fishy over here. This is way too easy. Well, if you do this, if you put it on the floor, it would be like, ah, something is, seems to be correct. So basically, if you cannot lift your, um, if you lift your knee too easily, it means something is fishy. It should hurt like hell over here. And if it doesn't, it means you're not well placed. What should you do in this case? First of all, get out of your comfort zone and face it. It's gonna hurt like hell. Hell, hell, hell. Secondly, this is a perfect exercise actually to work on your so, so place yourself in front of the mirror on the, or in front of the camera. Make sure that your belly button is facing the camera or um, the mirror, whatever. Grab your knee from behind you. Up. Grab your leg. You can balance yourself with both your fingers. Up. Now, you will naturally twist your hips a little bit if you're not flexible enough from here. That's natural, but it should hurt. It's, you should feel the whole part over here, like going from down up till the up. You should feel it stretching. Once you grab your knee, try to straighten your hips. You'll eventually have to go up a little bit. It's okay, as long as you're feeling the stretch. Now this is an advanced version. Most of you will probably feel like they're already dying at this stage. Congratulations and good job, you're on the right road, hang on. What happens when you manage to do the advanced correct split? Once you have the correct version, you can actually do many lovely variations, which includes, for example, up. Is another variation. You can actually go down even and keep it. You can even grab it with both of your arms and up, keep it. You can actually do plenty of things with this marvelous exercise, and most of all, it. You can actually use it for your bridge also and your semi bridge, but that will be in the next tutorial. So stay tuned and don't give up. Don't get discouraged. Life's too short for that and keep stretching.